So today I'm going to go through installing a solid state drive on a Lenovo T500 laptop. I'll be using the Kingston 64 gig B series. Uh, these drives are pretty cheap uh, and they're very reliable. They're not the fastest ones in the market, but I think they're a great value and a great way to get into solid state drives. First thing you're going to want to do is remove the battery and then you're going to locate the hard drive slot on the side. I'm using a standard screwdriver, you can pick them up at Walmart, uh, I got this for five bucks and it's magnetized so that's a good feature. It's just going to be one screw and you're going to feel this little thing come off the side. As you'll notice, there's a little ribbon, pull that out and it'll allow you to slide it right out. Now on this hard drive, you're going to have the two rubber drive rails and then you're going to have a metal cage. To remove this metal cage you're going to locate the screws on the side and just pull those off. Okay, take note of the orientation that the hard drive is in as you're taking it apart because you're going to want to take the solid state drive and make sure that the orientation is the same when you put it back in the caddy. Now I'm not sure who took this apart before me. I got this used but there should be four screws holding this in. Uh, I just noticed that there are only two. so. In these models, there will usually be four. Okay, put your hard drive back in the anti-static bag that your solid state drive came in. Wrap the rails back around, just like this. Okay. And then you can look inside and make sure you know which way the SSD should go back in. Push it in and then just reapply this brace here. And then just screw it back in and that's all there is to it. Just a couple of minutes and got a solid state drive.